welcome to race 11. Welcome to Stratford. I'll bring last races of the day. The Felix, Joshua Sullivan, Walgo, David Uli, Basic Cuisine, David Ladd, Great Sadler, Darren Thompson, Knock and Dolly, Bobbin, James Shea, Magic Word, Craig Beckwith, Tobin Air, Carpet, Hollywood, Marshall, Paul Parsons, Widow Rock Lover, Winnie Gerrard, Serelda Safford, Darren Thompson, Bello Tudor, Pontico Racing, Clock of Magic, Leila Malmensbrick, Our Central Barbie, Winnie Gerrard, Fistic, Leo Malmensbrick, Irish Court, Hollywood, Linda McMahon, Mark Cooper, Pork, Salad Honey, Martin Leiden, Spiritual Lady Jamari, and Take Talk Back May, sorry, Point Pool Racing. It's three mile one for a Norwich Chase on the very firm ground at Stratford. And the first one to show, Linda McMahon, and that's Matt Cooper's horse. Leads on the outside of Pope's Salad Honey on the inside. A couple of these horses last week fell. It's not a maiden, it's a novice chase, of course. But, uh, I may have said maiden at the beginning. That mark early on is window rock lever. We have two winners in the field. The Jocelyn trained the Panax and the David Lee trained Wild Rose. So one of them will be losing their unbeaten tag today. They're passing the winning post here at Stratford on Avon. Linda McMahon on the outside of Pope's Honey, then comes Irish Coat in third, one of the two of Derek Inter's horses, and then behind these comes Spivical Lady, and then comes Fist Tech and Wild Rose, Talk Back Mare, Vanishing Behind these, then the Palanax, and then comes Great Sadler, Magic Word, and Cyril the Saffron is behind these, then Noctilian Robin, Tobin our Carpet is behind these, and looking way back to the rear. Cloak of Magic, Liam on Men's Big, one of these one is just a bat marker. I apologise to Darren, I might have called him David or Derek twice last week. <laughs> ah, of course it's Darren, I should know. It's Pork Salad Honey in front though, by a lamp from Linda McMahon in second. Two defeatings back to a Irish Coat, Irish Coat, quote, sorry. And then comes Spivical Lady and then Fish Tank and Vanishing. Paul Parsons or that. And then Talk Back Mare. Daughter of Talk Mare was in this league last year, but for some reason I didn't save her as an eight year old and she must got injured. And then I forgot to export her. What well, happens? I hope Mark fixes that problem. I know somebody suggested it. It is a pain when you have to skip a year now for her. Yeah, she might back, be back at the end of the year in and out of the season because it probably will have another season. And pork salad honey will just be a Christmas break as usual, it's back in between it. Then my man in second, Irish quote, and then spherical lady and talk back May Wild Rose and vanishing magic word, fist tech, basic cuisine. So I'll just have one luck of Dolan Robin, Cloak of Magic, Tinker Tobinar Carpet and Great Sadler, Bernard Tudor. Ran over long distance last week, so I apologise. He ran over two miles of hurdles for some reason. It's three mile chases he wants. They got on, but it's just all one half left to run and none of these none of these have fallen yet last week. But all oh, these following hours, Irish quote, fist tech, talk about me all failed to complete. Got much better today though. That's Linda McMahon heads them down. Past the stands on the outside of Puck Salad. And these two have been disputing the lead so far. And then comes Irish quote the spherical lady back in four. Talk about me, fish tech. Well those of tracks these and then comes magic word. And so all the saffron and basic cuisine and then gets cloak of magic jump in this fence. So watch them go over oh, lost one. And it was a fest tech that went for Leon Mensberg. He got one left in the race. And yes, it'll be a danger to all that's for sure a poke salani. Has poked herself into the front from Linda McMahon in second. Irish quote is still there in third top back mare. The grey on the in in the middle. Well, on the outside of the Spivical Lady, then come Irish Quote and Wild Rose and made some progress. 
one from last week. I jump in that one, and then the back mark is the Window Rock Lover for Winnie Gerard. He's my man as the cameraman switches around again. Leads by a length of Pork Salad Honey in second top back may have made good ground into third and gets Irish called on Wild Road. Spherical Lady and Casilla the South one and then knock Dylan Robin and the Phalarax is making ground. He's on the main to Dangness and both coming up now from the Josh Silver and and David Uli and Beaten Horses have both made some progress. And looking back to the woods, the rear window, what the lover is really falling off the bat there. And might be pulled up pretty soon. As Lynn McMahon's being personal by Top Bat May, Spiritual Ladies back in third, and then comes Falanax, Wild Wolves, and Cloak of Dark, Cloak of Magic, and then it's a and then comes. Looking back, when the drop was up there, the it's dropped away. It's pucks out time. He's right towards the rear now. Talk back, me. Ooh, that's a bit big jump. It was big. It got over it, but it was a slow jump. It still leads by a bit of length now from the Palinax. Now moving into second. They got two left to him. Talk back, me. I fell last week. Leads by a length now from the Palinax in second. Behind his conspiracy lady. Trying to make some good ground now is Cloak of Magic. They're going on the running for the line. As they do so, it's top back made a couple of lengths clear inside the final field, three to four lengths clear. Spiritual ladies giving chase in sec, but top back may daughter of top may from last season is gonna take this and take it comfortably. And the jockey looking around here, we're getting quite close to the, to the end there, Spiritual Lady. That a good win for me. Top back may. Closed on the end, but Spiritual Lady didn't get on the in second, then the Phalanx, and then because Great Sadler in fourth. So, a win for Pontypool Racing. Second, the uh, Spiritual Lady Jim Murray. Third, the Phalanx, just with seven, lost its unbeaten record. The Great Soldier was in fourth, and Cloak of Magic was in fifth, while Rose only six. And then so far the seven and back to the back couple. Last with the pace was Tobinor and Carpet Front Hollywood.